Welcome back to Daily Blast Live. Today we are shining the DBL spotlight on helping kids with cancer feel less like patients and more like Disney princesses. Watch this. The Magic Yarn Project turns young cancer patients into fairy princesses. Holly Christensen is a mom and oncology nurse. She knew that the scalps of kids undergoing chemo are too sensitive for traditional wigs. So when her friend's daughter was diagnosed with cancer, Holly made her a Rapunzel wig made from soft yarn. Today, the Magic Yarn Project volunteers have made more than 8,000 wigs. And Magic Yarn Project founder Holly Christensen joins us now. Hey, Holly, let's get started. Now, as a nurse. Hi, how are you? Hey, as a nurse, what inspired you to make these wigs? Well, I spent some of my time as a nurse working in cancer. And having worked in cancer, one thing that I learned is that chemotherapy often leaves skin very sensitive. So most cancer patients are not able to tolerate wearing traditional wigs. And they often are in hospitals where they're very cold and they want to cover their heads to keep warm. So when my friend's daughter was diagnosed with cancer, I had the idea to make her a Rapunzel wig made of yarn built on a soft crochet beanie cap. So it would be something that would help cover her head and keep her warm and just help her to be a kid again during a time that's so scary and full of pain and uncertainty and illness. This is amazing. I, I've just, I think this is just so great. Tell us what happens to the children when they put on their Disney-inspired wig. We receive stories from families often that, you know, it was the first time that their child smiled in weeks and that after such long hospital stays and being so ill that just putting on that wig transformed them back into that imaginative child that that they have just kind of lost in that scary world of cancer. Now, Holly, this is such a magically brilliant concept. How can the DBL Nation get involved, including people who don't crochet like myself? So you can go on to our website um, and see the many ways you can get involved. We also are 100% volunteer operated and we operate strictly off of donations. So. So we appreciate, you know, even the smallest donations make a big difference in the life of a child battling cancer. Holly, thank you for being with us and what you're doing to make young cancer patients' lives just a little bit brighter. We are so proud of you and thank you for your time. Well, thank you so much for having me on. Oh my God, I know child should have to go through that, but to think that something, um, I don't wanna say so simple, can help transform the child and make them feel confident mm -hmm. and like a kid again is absolutely priceless. And I think they, it's okay to call it simple because they say true brilliance is, is simplicity. And it's just like something like this to make that, that Rapunzel wig is just like such a great idea. I so know. I'm sure that little girl loved it. I know. Amazing. Wow.